Hello guys and welcome to my summer project What a wonderful world. So this video, like I said, is going to be the introduction to my summer project use it up, which is a project where I basically try to get through my collection of body care. It's kind of a play off of a project pan and I'm just trying to finish off as many products as I can within one certain season. So I will be starting it today in June and I will update you guys in July. And the final update will be in August. And then in September, we will start with the fall project. So if you've never seen one of my videos before, go ahead and click subscribe because you are going to want to see the wonderful scent combinations that I came up with today. Okay, for the first body care combo, I am bringing back Beach Nights. This is my final two Beach Nights products. I'm so sad to finish them, but I'm very excited to use them. So this is going to be a beachy marshmallow vanilla coconut routine. So first off, like I said, we're starting off with Beach Nights. I have the Shower Gel and the Fine Fragrance Mist, and these are both from 2022. The notes on Beach Nights are Toasted Marshmallow, Sea Salt Breeze, S'mores Accord, Beach Driftwood, and Creamy Vanilla. I think, honestly, you can smell every single part of these scent notes. It has a little bit of that like driftwood and breeze to where it's kind of a fresh scent, it definitely has that marshmallow and vanilla to make it a little bit gourmand. And it's just honestly the perfect summer scent. It's not too sweet. It's not too fresh. It is the perfect mixture of both. So I'm super excited to use them both. I'm gonna go ahead and mark them where they're at now and I will update you guys next time. So after marking these two, it does look like I might've used these last year as well. So the shower gel is right up to here. I did use it a little bit. And then the Fine Fragrance Mist is about almost halfway used. So I'm probably not going to finish it this year. And I'm okay with that because I would love to hold on to it for another season. So that's these two. And then for moisturizers in this routine, I'm putting in both a body cream and a body lotion. I live in South Texas, so it gets really hot in the summers. And sometimes I don't want to put on body creams. So I wanted to have a lotion in this project too just in case, you know, I was feeling one or another on a certain night. So I have Meet Me in Miami, which I just picked up from semi-annual sale. The notes are Breezy Palm Trees, Cabana Coladas, and Suntan Days. This one is definitely a like coconut resort scent. It kind of has like that suntan lotion smell. So I'm really excited to pair it with Beach Nights. I think it's going to be the perfect complement to that like driftwood vanilla. So I think that's going to be perfect. And then whipped coconut milkshake, I've actually already been using and not really like tracking it. So it is already down to here. And the notes on this are vanilla ice cream, toasted coconut and sensual amber. Oh, sorry, sugared amber. This one is just a super gourmand coconut, basically just coconut vanilla in my opinion. So this one's a super sweet version. Um, I think this sweet coconut is going to be the perfect mixture to go with the whipped marshmallow portion of Beach Nights. So I'm excited for that. And then let's get into the perfume that I'm going to be pairing with this. So I'm actually going to be putting in my little mini from Ayana Grande. This is Moonlight. Now I know this is kind of a weird combo because this is a floral, floral gourmand, I think is what they describe it as, but it does have notes of marshmallow. It has notes of driftwood and I think some other crisp C kind of scent notes. I've actually never used this one, so I'm not sure how it's going to pair, but I'm thinking it might be a really good, nice um, scent to bring out the fresh portion of Beach Night. So I'm actually pretty excited to try it out. So here's my little mini, never been used before. It's got this gorgeous, like holographic packaging. It's really pretty. So very excited to try this one. I'll let you guys know what I think of it. In the next update but excited to get some use out of it and finally try it i've definitely had this for more than five years so excited to get to try it the next scent combo is a very very simple fresh coconut scent combo and this is fresh coconut and cotton can't get any simpler than that so i do have it in the fine fragrance mist and in the body cream like i said i don't know if i'm gonna want a body cream during the summer when it's super hot so i'm happy i do have a lotion in there but i've actually been using this for the last couple of weeks and I really do enjoy this. It is like that perfect fresh scent for just before bed. So I've been enjoying it at night. The notes are coconut, coastal breeze and beachside cotton. So I really like that this one is fresh. I don't often go for fresh scents. 
I really am not a fresh girly, but recently I've been really loving it. So I think I'm going to really enjoy this one, especially when it starts to get, you know, in the upper 90s here. I think I'm really going to love it. I did actually just realize that this little window here is see-through, so you can actually see the body cream, which is kind of fun. Um, but since I have been using it a little bit in the last couple of weeks, it is right here instead of being full. So that's the um, body cream. And then for the Fine Fragrance Mist, I have not been using it, so it is still completely unused. We are up at the top here. This packaging is just so beautiful. I'm really excited for a fresh scent. I think I'm going to love it. And then to pair with that, I do have a little replica mini perfume that I'm going to put in. And this one is Lazy Sunday Morning. I'll put the scent notes at the bottom. I'm pretty sure this is a fresh sheet scent. So I think this is going to go perfect with my cotton portion of fresh coconut and cotton, cotton, and then fresh linen sheets. I think it's going to be really good together. So excited to have some sort of fresh scent, see how I enjoy it. Just really excited to try these ones and kind of branch out from my normal gourmand pattern. So for my last combo, I am going full vanilla. You guys know it would not be a scent routine or a project use it up without some sort of vanilla in it. And I'm doing it really crazy with this vanilla routine. So let's just go ahead and get started. So the star of the show here, which inspired this whole routine is Pacifica's Island Vanilla Body Wash. And actually both the Island Vanilla Body Wash and the perfume from Pacifica, which they kindly sent to me over on Instagram. Um, I have no obligation to post about them, but they of course are not paying me or anything to say anything about this, but I'm excited to try it because it is not just a simple vanilla scent. It is supposed to be a little bit of a breeze. So I'm excited to try that. It doesn't have scent notes on here, so I'll put it down below if there are any. But yeah, I have the Calming Plant Powered Aromatherapy Body Wash. This is vanilla, lavender, and white tea. There we go. There's the scent notes right there on the front. And this is a really big bottle. It is 12 fluid ounces. I love that it has a pump. So excited to try this one out. And then the perfume as well. I think it's so cute with the flowers on the design. You kind of can't see it too easily because the liquid inside is so dark, but it's really pretty just me holding it up to the sun in front of my window. It's really pretty. So I'm excited to try this one, see how it wears. And to pair with it, I've got my new Wild Madagascar Vanilla. Well, new to me, I know this scent has been out for quite some time, but it did just come back out at SAS and I picked it up. I want to say for like 350, so a really great deal but I do remember having this in high school and maybe even in middle school. So it's definitely been out since like the 2010s, maybe even earlier, but this scent is so nostalgic to me. It's kind of crazy. The notes are wild Mas Madagascar Accord, African pear and wild jasmine. To me, it really is just a jasmine kind of fragrance. I'm not getting African pear, whatever that smells like. And I'm not getting wild Madagascar cord, which I don't even know what that would smell like. But yeah, I'm getting a ton of jasmine, maybe with just a little hint of vanilla. So excited to have this one. I think it'll pair really well with my like island theme that I'm going for with this one. And yeah, this is a full lotion. So we'll see how much I can get through in the project. And to go with it in the shower, I am going to put in this Dionys Goat Milk Skincare whipped body scrub and this is in the scent vanilla bean i figured just having a super simple vanilla body scrub would be great for my project and go with pretty much any of these shower gels that i'm putting in but this one is a more rough and coarse body scrub so this is going to be the only one that i'm putting in the project right now it does lather up pretty hard and i have used it a few times already so we are about halfway used on this one it won't take me too long to use it and then i will probably go try to buy another body scrub. We'll see. I couldn't find any on a good deal uh, during SAS. So we'll see maybe later on during the sale, they'll go down in price. But yeah, that's the one I'm going to put in for now. And this will be the only body scrub that I'm going to be focusing on. And the last thing that I'm putting in the project is my Sol de Janeiro 62 Pistachio and Salted Caramel. Now you may be thinking, okay, Pistachio does not really go with Island Vanilla, but I don't care. I'm going to be honest, I don't care. This one to me does not sound like pistachio at all. I really just get like a caramel vanilla. I don't know. This scent is like intoxicating though. It stays on my body the entire day. It stays on my clothes. Every time I perspire just a little bit, 
it the scent gets elevated and I think it's so gorgeous. I think it just mixes so well with my body's pH and it performs really well on me. So this is one of my favorites. I'm really sad that I will definitely be finishing it super soon. It is almost done. As you can tell, we are already down to here. So not a lot to go. I will definitely be repurchasing this. My birthday is coming up in August and I'll probably ask for a full size. It's just so good. It's really unmatched if you've never tried it. I don't think they could really top this formula of body spray because it just lasts so long. So absolutely love this one. I'm going to be so sad to see it go, but I will be super happy to use it. So that is it for the introduction of my summer project Use It Up. As you guys saw, I put in those three body care combos. We have our wonderful gourmand marshmallow vanilla scent with Beach Nights. And then we have my fresh coconut and cotton routine for that little fresh pick me up. And then our last body care combo is my max out on vanilla combo, which I'm really excited about. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I want to know down below, what scent are you using for the summertime? What is like your signature summer scent? Please let me know down in the comments and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.